Good morning, good morning, good morning. Jen Kavasi, Jekyll Bates, and this is the first workshop update that I've done in a couple of weeks because I've been, hey, I've been away on vacation. Family reunion time, back to Maryland time. It has been barking dogs. Yeah. Maybe it's just that one. We'll see. Anyways, it has been uh, a fun last couple of weeks home with the family. Um, Haverty Grace, Philadelphia, Virginia, like three states. It was like I was on tour. It was great. Um, saw concerts, went to gardens, did some fishing. Didn't catch a whole lot while I was home. Chesapeake Bay is really blown out from all the rain they've had back east. But let's get into it real quick. What we've got to show you guys today. Um, we're going to start out with this Sammy in a largemouth bass. Hey look, I've got paint on my hands again. Haven't had that in a couple of weeks. Solid pattern. It's a four inch Sammy. Really good action. Brook trouts. Got a couple of them going out this morning. I might do a couple on auction as well. One of the neat things about the brook trout is, is aside from the fact it's a fun pattern, it's also a very effective pattern. Uh, and not just in the north, uh, not just the, the northern border states up towards Canada like New York and all those places, but this 2.5 rattling. These are fresh off of the finishing rack, so we still have some cleanup to do this morning just a solid solid pattern let's bring some more stuff into focus here there we go we've got a couple more of these um, this is a, a three order three piece order heading out the door this morning this is from Michael Ornstein's uh, take it from here pattern this is what I call the Steelers Nation pattern there we go it's always helpful when it focuses and this is in a dinger there you go, Brian. This is in a dinger in the D65, which is a duo facsimile. Love these patterns, great pattern. Swims very well, weighted very well. Um, worth every penny of the blank price. And it's not that, for, for stateside blank prices, it is definitely competitive um, for what you get. The value of, of Brian's stuff is really, really good. This is a Classic American thread fin. Got that fade coming down. You can see the scaling mist. And that's that's pretty much in a pearl white that's over top of the blue. Creates that mist. And yes, that's another way that you guys can go white over dark colors. And you get that scaling effect. It's very, very good. It's muted. We've already shown you guys these, but this is a caraway bone pattern and a Jekyll popper. This is no slouch popper either. It is not a knockoff. feathering in of the fins, a shad dot on there, a little texture. We've got a, I got an Indian red fading back into that burnt sienna. So I love sienna. It's one of my favorite colors to work with. You can see that pearl pop on the sides and back down. So these are going to get cleaned up this morning. And then last but certainly not least, Quest for another Night King. No clean fingernails around here, folks. We work for a living. But just a fantastic pattern. The eyes were laid in by hand. Get a closer shot of the eyes right there. That's all hand done. This is one of this is one of the most popular patterns to date. It really is. Got that imaging, the depth in here. 
This is obviously the Night King. Good feathering. www.jekyllbaits.com. Catch me at Twitter at Jen Cravasi. Instagram, Jekyll424. Facebook at Jekyll Bates. You guys have a fantastic day. And we will see you on the water. Happy casting.